What's going on, Salt Strong Nation? We're doing a little bit of jetty fishing out here today, and I want to talk to you guys really quick about a fantastic bait for fishing on the jetty in wintertime, and that's blue crabs. I've got a fresh dead one here, and I'm going to show you guys exactly how to quarter it or half it uh, with these marine shears and hook it on a circle hook to catch big redfish, black drum, all the species that we're out here targeting on the jetty. So let's go ahead and dive right in. So the first step to preparing your crab to get rigged is to cut off the legs and the flippers. This is just going to make sure it's an easier presentation for those redfish or black drum to come and pick up. Now be careful with the flipper. You don't cut it too short because that is actually the target we're going to use right there for when we do rig this crab. Now to get the crab split into halves, which is the first step, you're going to want to cut through the top of the shell. I usually like to stick the point of the scissors straight through the crab and then start to cut down. You have to be really careful uh, because if you just do this a little bit too forcefully, very possible you're going to crack the crab improperly and it's going to mess up the way that the bait will be rigged later on. So just continue cutting through the top, find your way around to the back of the crab. And then you will end up with two halves. And this is when we can start to have our rigging possibilities. You can rig them just half ways, uh, or you can rig them in quarters, which I will show. But for both ways, we will be using an octopus circle hook. So where you're gonna wanna start is through that back flipper where we talked about earlier, that's our target point. And ideally we're gonna go through that flipper and run it through the back of the shell. The best place for that barb to be is not facing downward on the crab. There's a lot of places it could get hooked, but rather through that back where you can see the hook point will be exposed for when a fish comes to grab it. We wanna make sure we get the hook all the way through and it's not just the tip that's sticking through. Make sure it's fully exposed for when those fish come to take that presentation. Now, what you can also do is split these crabs into quarters. This is gonna allow you to get more out of a single crab because they do tend to be pretty expensive and you would just cut straight down the side of the crab. That way you still keep it intact for the most part. Again, be very careful with the way you're going to rig them and in the way that you would rig these quarters, uh, again, you still are gonna have that quarter that we just talked about how to rig. It would go back through that flipper just like you just saw or you could rig this other half through the bottom and again through the top. We want to make sure that that exposed hook point is through the very top of the crab shell instead of facing downward because it's more likely to get snagged on the crab itself. So right there, you've got your presentation for that other quarter. It's just gonna be easily picked up when a fish comes to find it. All right guys, so that's how you half or quarter a blue crab. We're gonna put some of these out, see if we can't catch some more black drum. We've already had a pretty good bite with these today. Uh, so thank you guys again so much for watching. And if you wanna see more awesome fishing tips, definitely check us out at saltstrong.com. And if you're new to Salt Strong, just know that we're the number one online fishing club in America because we literally guarantee we're going to help you catch more fish, save money on tackle, and make friends fast. So we're looking forward to seeing you in the Salt Strong Insider community soon, and thanks again for watching.